Welcome to Joey C TV. Today I'm back at this creepy abandoned church to do an alone challenge. Um, such a cool place. Now today I brought my static camera. I'll put it in this room, then the back room. I just feel this place has so much to offer and really we don't get to do churches that often. I feel a, an overwhelming uh, sadness here. I feel that this place has got a lot of stories to tell. And uh, it's just as creepy in the daytime as it is at night, let me tell you. Anyway, you're coming with. Let's do this. I had to come back to this magnificent church. This is the property in the daytime, so it gives you a better perspective. There is the assisted living facility. Back there is the daycare center. And of course here is this amazing church. So today I'm bringing a static camera. I really, really need to know if I'm gonna pick up anything here. And let's face it, we don't come across abandoned churches very often. So this is like such a good opportunity. Said all the stuff that was ripped out of here. Anyway. What a shame. I always looked up to you, now we're left cold and sad by someone, the devil's best friend, someone who offends us all. I have my static camera set up right here, and the weirdest thing, while I was setting that up, I heard something back there. What the heck? <laughs> um, if anybody's wondering, I did already say a prayer before coming in here, so I, I am prayed up right now, and um, let's go ahead and check this out. I hope this doesn't overheat. This is where I sat last time. I sat over here. So much stuff all over. It's such a shed, sad thing to see everything all torn up. It's weird, I wonder if anything here has changed at all, it's hard to tell. I may say another prayer before I leave, just to include everybody. 
Um, the reason why I prayed before I came in, instead of praying on cameras, sometimes people don't appreciate it, some do, so I, I kind of was deciding maybe I should just do it myself and leave it out, but tell me what you think. Exactly as we left it. Which is a good thing. What the heck is that thing doing here, man? It looks like a chicken leg. <laughs> so like uh some kind of like ritual thing? I don't know. No way, is there a Hot Wheels car in here? There is a Hot Wheels car in here. Oh, wow. Well, you know, I don't take anything, but man, that is cool. Now, you guys know I love my Hot Wheels cars. Man, that is such a cool find. But, uh, oh, sorry, can't take it. Wanna take it, just can't. Did you guys hear that? It sounded like somebody took a step and it wasn't me. I wonder if that static camera is going to pick up anything. This is the room that I thought I was hearing like voices last time and stuff. It's right in here. I'm turning over stuff on the floor that has names on it because I don't want to put that on film, so... In case you're wondering why I'm bending over every so often. So what's really weird is I think I keep hearing what sounds like somebody walking around this place. Now, I don't think there is, but it sure sounds like it. Let's hope not.
in the daytime, it's totally different, isn't it? I mean, obviously it's the same building, but like the feel is different. Still creepy though. very very heavy in here so I can't wait to put the static camera in that other building in the back of the church because that seems to me creepy and I also want to pick this up off the floor. Hundred and one ways to praise a child. I don't know, it's sad. I, I really wanted to come here and take all the Bibles and like donate them and stuff, but you know, I can't do that. Not mine. To donate. So this will very likely be the last time I ever come here as well. It's, uh, it's really sad, actually. But I am drawn here. Doesn't that bird look real? Huh. Something about this place draws me in and I'm on the way after this to head to see my mom. Is talking coming from over there. There must be maybe a neighborhood back there, I would assume. Funny how one insect can damage so much grain. Sir Elton John. Yeah, I'm going to set up the static camera in here. See how it's doing. Sometimes it overheats, and uh, let's hope it didn't overheat. Yeah, it looks like it's still going actually. Nice. So it's weird, like when I was here at night, this room back here just seemed to have voices everywhere. 
wondering if we'll pop that thing again. Let's see. That up right here. And the weirdest thing, while I was setting that up, I heard something back there. What the heck? <laughs> um, if anybody's wondering, I did already say a prayer before coming in here. So I, I am prayed up right now. And um, let's go ahead and check this out. say another prayer before I leave, just to include everybody. Um, the reason why I prayed before I came in, instead of praying on cameras, sometimes people don't appreciate it, some do, so I, I kind of was deciding maybe I should just do it myself and leave it out, but tell me what you think.
static camera is going to pick up anything. doing sometimes it overheats and uh, let's hope it didn't overheat yeah, it looks like it's still going actually There we go. All right. Truthfully, during the day, I feel creeped out, but I'm not really hearing stuff like I did at night. But then again, it could be one of those things that, you know, you come here and you think you didn't capture anything and you play it back and you never know. So I could be wrong, but it sounds like like a humming, maybe, or it could be outside noise, but it sounds like a humming in here. Tell me what you think if you hear anything. 
creepy. <laughs> really uneasy feeling. I don't want to call out to anything, guys. I changed that up. I think that a place like, see, what was that? A place like this could get you an attachment that you don't want. I really believe that because it was sacred ground, it's now like a place where, like, maybe demons would go. That's just my opinion. Past experience as well. Okay. Where's the camera? Yep, shut off. Damn. Okay, I guess I'll give it a minute to cool down. Hello? It sounded like the door opened. That's so strange. It sounded like that door opened. I'm going to try this camera one more time. Facing this way. Again, it overheats so easily. Is it recording? Yeah. I don't know how long it'll stay on. All right, so I got a camera here and a camera there. So quiet here. I'm here all by myself and it's so quiet. Is that a camera here now? Level it out a little bit. There we go. All right.
But then again, it could be one of those things that, you know, you come here and you think you didn't capture anything and you play it back and you never know. And I'm going to let this record this way, over here on a different angle. I'm going to try. The creepiest part about being here is that like, I feel like somebody's going to come walking. Sounded like a voice. I'm going to turn the recorder on and just see if it picks up anything. I'm not going to ask questions because I don't want to invite something to me, if that makes sense. I really feel like I did in the past and it was really hard to get rid of. It took a lot of pain and suffering to get rid of that. Just went off again. Let me try and see. Maybe there is something on here. something go gel, I think. That just went off again. You know, maybe I didn't, I thought I did, I thought I heard something say gel, but it it's hard, too hard to tell. Like I said, I'm not going to call out because I think when I call out, I'm actually opening, like something about me opens up a pathway to whatever, and I don't want that to be attached to me. If it reaches out to me, that's different. It's how I do it that makes all the difference, I believe, and could be wrong. It's, uh, Let's check out a little more. Like I said, we'll give that a minute again because obviously it's overheating.
So I've got a camera here and a camera there. So quiet here. I'm here all by myself and it's so quiet. Creepiest part about being here is that, like, I feel like somebody's gonna come walking. Yeah, that sounded like a voice. Right, guys, that was really cool. Um, did we pick up anything? I don't know. I kind of don't think so. Um, still, cool, creepy abandoned church. It's not often that we get to investigate one, and um, this place really got a piece of my heart. It really, truly does. Um, sad. It's a sad place. Hopefully you pick something up. Um, I'm not going to stay much longer here. Maybe I'll check out the other buildings on my way out. Anyway, I'm, thank you for coming. This was a cool place. This is a creepy place. Go in love. Go in peace. Alright, I'm going to pick up the static camera. Who knows, maybe we actually captured something on this. Sometimes this light is so hard to shut off. Come on. Shut off. What? There we go. All right. Well, we're going to say goodbye to this once fabulous place. Thank you, Jesus, for being my Savior. And I know that cross is a constant reminder. Let this place go and rest in peace for this place. Hopefully, this has some good memories for people. But I, I think they're tearing this down soon. So, anyway, well, let's get out while well, the getting's good. That's what I was saying. Bye, Mr. Bear. I guess we could check out those other places before we go. I'll run back to the car, drop off my ski poles and my static camera. Oh, you know what's back there? There's a body of water. How cool is that? I didn't know that. I think that's a body of water. Oh, interesting. Huh. I didn't know that. 